a lot of you guys are abusing the fact that you get to keep the trailer. Yeah, I got a drip, want to make money because I can see, yeah. And I was so down and so down in my own. Da -da 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 YouTube, YouTube, what is going on? I'm your host, Runaway Child, and I'm back at y'all with another one. If you haven't hit the subscribe button, man, take the opportunity. Go ahead, hit that subscribe button right now. And if you're already subscribed to the channel, man, hey, throw a like on this video. A like don't cost you anything to throw on this video, so please show your boy some love. But anyhow, what I want to talk to y'all today about was I have been hearing some rumors about this power-only stuff going on where basically, you know, you go and they're already preloaded trailers. You can just go pick the trailers up do what you got to do deliver the load and you're able to keep the trailer for almost up to two weeks three weeks sometimes you know these 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 dispatchers and stuff like that they don't mind you keeping the trailer but they are saying that a lot of you guys are abusing the fact that you get to keep the trailer i got a guy by the name of alex good energy and uh i'll let him talk to y'all more about it I really want to just spread some awareness because, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm in talks with a lot of the big dogs um, in the industry. You know what I'm saying? I talk to a lot. Of, I got a lot of good relationships that I don't even really expose uh, with higher ups, right, in the industry. Timberland, living legend, my brother. How you feeling, boss? Uh, I'll be in Miami and actually next week. I'll be in Miami next week, Timberland, and um, I'm going to pull up on you, all right? I'm going to um, definitely take you up on that offer. So next, next Wednesday, I'll be in town, all right, my brother? Hope all is well. But anyway, so I made the post today to create some awareness because um, people are abusing the power only network, um, specifically with J.B. Hunt. There's a few other people that do power only, uh, but J.B. Hunt, I feel, has probably one of the, the biggest network of trailers in the country right now. Right. And. I've trained a lot of dispatchers. I've, I've put a lot of, I put thousands of people in, in business. And I just wanted to be clear that uh, when you abuse something, you're going to lose it. And one of the things is power only loads is a niche in the industry, right? Where if you don't have a trailer, right? If you just got the, use this as an example. If you just got this part right here, okay? If you just got this part right here, Sabrina, what's good? But you ain't got this part, okay? You ain't got this part. You just got this. You just got the tractor. You don't got the trailer, right? Some of y'all are getting in business and you just getting the, the truck. So what happens is you can either go lease and buy a trailer or you can just use the tractor and hook up to somebody else's trailer, right? So we're going to say that this is J.B. Hunt's trailer right here. This ain't your trailer. This is J.B. Hunt's trailer, right? This, tr this trailer is loaded with, with freight already in it. All you got to do is take your truck and hook up to this trailer, go deliver the load, and drop the trailer. And then you just go hook up to another trailer. Or you can literally go get empty. You, you empty the load, and then you now you got the empty trailer. And now you can use this same trailer that belongs to J.B. Hunt, for example, and go get another load and use it for a little while, right? Now, what J.B. Hunt says is, hey, look, we got a lot of uh, loads that we need ran with our own trailers. So they're asking you to use their trailers and make the money, but at least run loads for J.B. Hunt. So what's happening is, instead of running other J.B. Hunt loads, they're using the trailers and going and hooking up and getting freight from other companies, which ain't illegal and you can do that right but you just can't only do that that's the thing like yo everywhere might not have another jb hunt load you might have to pick up a, a land star load or a night logistics load um in order to get to another market but what people are doing is they're literally after they drop the original load off they're getting empty and they're using the jb hunt trailer and they're running freight for two, three, four weeks at a time, and they're not even communicating, and they just running off with the trailers, right? And they're bringing it back when they want to bring it back. And that's what the issue is. You understand what I'm saying? What up, man? Yeah. What's happening? What's good, kid? Nothing much. Yo, 
my cousin being nice to y'all. <laughs> so let me let me let me let me say let me spell it out the the way it's supposed to be spelled out. I seen comments in here that people finesse free trailers. That's stealing. <laughs> y'all want to go to jail? I've been there. I've been there. Y'all want to go to jail? I want because I don't want to go back. That's Grand Theft Auto. That's Grand Theft Auto. You're going to get your carry in trouble. You're going to get the driver in trouble. You're going to get yourself in trouble. And y'all got us looking crazy. I think they're capping. I, I think y'all are here capping. I'm not sure. Nah, I, I mean, no, I, I don't think they're capping. I, I really think because I had a conversation with JB Hunt today. They they can't find trailers. It was it's, it was so bad. I remember a few months ago that there was a few power onlys that would get booked, right? And the broker would say, oh, go to such and such location and pick up this trailer. Trailer gone. They go to this location, trailer go, and then they can't figure out, they can't pinpoint the trailer number to a load. So it got to the point that some people are just going to the JB Hunt yard and just picking up a trailer and just running with it and doing just running loads with it. They're not even booking a load no more to go to 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 you to at least finesse it. Finesse them is the word, and get a uh, and run one load and complete it. Then use the trailer. They actually go into the yard. And just picking up these trailers and just, all right, I'm out. And just running with they and running with their trailer. That's that's stealing. That <laughs> is stealing. That is stealing. That's crazy. Y'all, I mean, listen, I wouldn't even be bragging on on these comments and you know, it's like telling it's like telling on yourself. It's like the rappers rapping in they in their music and telling on themselves. You y'all bugging right now. <laughs> listen, man. Like I said, bro, I just, I knew that it would reach a lot of people. So I just put the PSA out there. Cause again, I know that, I know people, some people need that, that power only yeah. like, you know what I'm saying? Some people yeah. ain't, ain't in position to get a trailer or buy a trailer right now, especially when the, when the prices was inflated, like it, it really helped a lot of people to be able to run uh, without um actually owning the trailer, man, which I go mess it up, man. But I, I just want, I just wanted to go on record that Alex came on here and gave y'all the heads up before right. it crashes. <laughs> like I was literally on the phone with JB Hunter apologizing because I felt like I felt partially responsible. And you know, I felt like, you know, just the both of us is partially responsible. Like I don't let them know like we are not teaching that. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm we not, are not teaching that. We are not responsible. <laughs> we are not teaching that. You know what I'm saying? Because it's already, you know, a lot of them a lot of the major brokers already know, you know. This is what we teach. I mean, not, not that, but we teach people how to get into the business. We teach them how to dispatch, but we teach them, you know, how to do it with integrity. But right. this is unethical. You can't, you cannot, not, not have these people trailer and just running like it belongs to you. That's crazy. I mean, those trailers also got like a tracking system and it pings. So it leaves a record of every location, every city that, it, that it's been in. So also, I'm going to just give you all a heads up too. JB Hunt also said that for the carriers who do it, they're gonna charge them five hundred dollars per day. So if you have any, if you have any invoices or any any loads that that you that you you know didn't get paid out yet, they're gonna just start taking the money per day, five hundred dollars per day. So I'm just letting y'all know that. I mean, as they should, as yeah. they should. Yeah, so anyway. I can't do that. Y'all gotta communicate with these people, man. That's that's that. That's I mean, it's not your damn trailer. Go get your own. Period. It's causing them as a company to lose money because people aren't doing what they're supposed to be doing. Well, that is the rumor, and I don't know what y'all gonna have to do to get it straight, but if you know somebody who running who who is running these type loads and you know somebody who is on these power only loads, hey man, tell them. It's about to come to an end if they keep doing the stuff that they doing. That's all I'm gonna say. You know what I'm saying? Hey, it's about to come to an end. Y'all fixing to screw it up for everybody, the ones who doing the right thing. Y'all fixing to screw it up, screw it up for them. Y'all know, like I always say, hey, send this video out to somebody, somebody that you know that might be in this situation and and they got the trailers and they're doing the things that they're supposed to be doing. Well, for the person who's doing the, the stuff that they're not supposed to be doing, fixing to mess it up for them. So you might want to talk to them, tell them, hey, get on board because... It's about to come to an end if, if they if they don't quit. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't gonna talk y'all head off. Give y'all a little short video, let y'all see that I'm not lying, I'm not playing. This is what's going on in the industry. You know what I'm saying? I'll leave all the links in the description. But till next time, runaway child, and we are out.